going on Flash fans? Mr. Dark Phoenix is back with the newest episode review. I'm so sorry everything has been so late. I got a job now and I'm still trying to work out the timing and the kinks of everything. So in that respect, please bear with me. But you can still follow me on social media like my Facebook page, my Twitter, and my Twitch for updates and all that fun. So if you want to get to know me right here in the description bar below. I love you guys. Let's jump into the episode. We'll talk over my channel later on. If you haven't seen it yet, come back when you have. And if you have seen it, let's jump right on into the newest episode of The Flash, Fury Rogue. Round. Rogue. Because they furious. The thing of crazy. Think of crazy, and he's gotten into cartoonish supervillainy. And I feel like when they make a when they make a villain that you can that, that's relatable and not just straight up evil, you're like, okay. But then it's like his wife trying to be like his wife, and she was like, I thought he was like come to you don't do that, I think, for us. I was like, she about to betray you? I'm pretty sure he saw that. I'm pretty sure that that's one of the things he saw coming. Because remember when he drugged her with that weird, uh, with the tears from the, like, the, uh, the skinny dude? Like, he was like, your mind is, like, one of the only things that can destroy me type things. So I'm pretty sure he's got that under lock and key. I'm pretty sure he's thought about a scenario like that. And we bring back Leo Snark from Earth-X. And he's getting married to Ray. I love Captain Cold's performance. I like how they let him be more sassy with Captain Cold, you know? Like, I'm gonna miss him. God, I wish they hadn't killed him off on Legends. But then, but then, but then they brought him back as a bad guy again. So, I think this, this is his last performance as Captain Cold, but we'll see what happens. I do really hope they still do, like, the, the, the Rogue War in, like, another season of The Flash. But because Captain Cold and Heatwave aren't there, I feel like they kind of deserve it. So, kind of feel like they should do that again, but it's fine. You know what? We also meet Siren X, because, you know, you got a Katie cast, you need to pass her around. And Siren X is more powerful than Black Siren, because she could hear sound, like, everywhere. So I'm guessing that that's what makes her a great assassin. But I wasn't even aware that she... Can, can Black Canary do that? Or, or did they just upgrade her for the sake of the show and just to, to, to differentiate her from Black Siren? So, I don't know. I just like seeing Katie Cassidy be bad. She was good as Siren X, so it's all good. She got the Echo thing going on. Uh, Barry mourns for Ralph, because that was the whole point of this episode. He's, like, bottling his emotions in, which is never good. So it's like, cry, Barry. It's okay. Cree. Cree, bro. We got you. It's all good. And Caitlyn is still mourning for Killer Frost almost, but like she found a little bit of speck of dark matter. But in the but in the but in the preview for this episode for this week, it shows um DeVoe doing like a big white mist of power. So that's probably the Killer Frost powers, which I feel like he got by accident. I feel like he got them by accident, but he's just running with it. Because he was like, Oh, I wasn't expecting frost powers, but I'll take them, you know, like my son, the Thinker, is fucking Mega Man taking all the fucking powers from people he's killed. And he's, oh my god, the Thinker is Mega Man. Oh my god, that's the best reference I can ever think of. And he, oh, oh you got you, you gotta factor in emotion. You know, like, the Thinker don't believe in that shit. He's still, like, one of my favorite villains. Don't get me wrong, Zoom will always be my favorite villain. Zoom... Uh, reverse Flash, Thinker, they will always be, like, my favorites, because, like, Zoom whoop Barry ass all over town, and he was just greatly performed by my man Teddy, and I just like this episode a lot. It's definitely, we're definitely going into, like, the finale territory, you know, like, I think we have a couple episodes left, so don't forget to hit subscribe for that. Uh, follow me on Twitch for gaming content, follow me on Twitter and Facebook for social media updates. I love you guys so much. What do you think about the episode? Comment down below and let me know. Don't forget to bear with me as I still have this, I got my job and I'm trying to work in the time. Um, what I think I might start doing is doing the reviews the night of. I'll just record the videos. Then when I get home, the night, the day, you know, once I get home, I get home at like five o'clock. I'll work on the videos, upload them then. So, I don't know. Bear with me. I love you nerds so much. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Comment, rate, subscribe. Share their awesome nerdy friends. Stay on the grind. Stay positive. Everything happens for a reason. And I love and support you the same way you love and support me. 
Always remember that through good times and bad times, you geek out. And enjoy your lives, and I'll catch you guys next time for another great video.